So this is how to use the Spectranet app. First, you need to download the app. They equally have a website, but the website is basically the same thing with the app. And I basically just prefer to use apps. So you, you go to your Play Store and then you want to download Spectranet. So it can be on iOS or Android. So after downloading it, you are going to be asked to log in. But there is a chance that you do not know your login code or your password. So what you have to do is you have this chat icon right here. So you click on the chat icon. You ask them. Tell them that you do not know your password or your username. They are going to ask you for your IME number that you are going to find somewhere around this box. So you just give them the number. They are going to give you the password and then your username and then you can log in. So when you log in, this is the app and the app is just very simple. You just use it to keep track of what you are doing with your data. So right here, you can see that I have, I've used 29 gig that it gave me and this is the next renewal date. This is my current account balance. This is the account ID. And if I wanted to renew, I can just click on renew and I have to send money and renew this. So here you can see all the offers you have with the history of your payments. You can locate them, blah, 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 all of that good stuff. So if you want to come down, if you want to make payments, you can come here and click on make payment. But before then, you see the current plan that you are using. Currently, I am on the plan that came with the MiFi itself. So this is the plan itself here. So if you want to change plans, you can click on right here that says plan. And then you can say you want to click on renew plan or you can change plan now. You can check the plan on expiry, change the plan on expiry, or you can do top up. So let's say you want to change the plans now. You can come here and you can click on this. When you click on that, you are going to see a drop down of all the plans that they have. So I don't know why this is not coming up now, but ordinarily it should just come up and you can see all the plans that they have and you can select any one that you want and you can click on confirm and you can proceed with it. But if you just wanted to top up to have money in your account so you can just choose any plan you want, you can go back. If you come back right here, if you come to the home and you come here where it says make payments, you click on make payments, you have the different options that you can use to make payments. You can use web pay which is I'm using InterSwitch. This is like the most common. You can use online payments. You can use bank transfers where you have to send Spectranet money and they have to help you do the recharge. And they told me, I contacted them about this. They told me that that would take one hour. So if you are okay with that, you can do that. But sometimes you don't have one hour. So it's just better you use WebPay and have things work um, maybe faster for you. So you can use recharge vouchers and spectra coins i don't really know how you get this too but if you wanted to make a bank payment they give you the accompanying account that you can send to either zenit bank fcmb and after that you want to send them an email to this address all right so they will credit your account and you will find it in your balance if you wanted to use web pay you can just click on web pay web pay is by interswitch and interswitch is a top reputable company so you can put the amount that you want to fund right here and then you can click on submit it's going to take you to the um interswitch page where you now have to put your regular naira card to make this um payment so so from here you can either select to pay with your card directly or you can use quick teller if you have quick teller i think quick teller is by interswitch too so i'm not very sure but i think so so if you wanted to use your card, which might just be more convenient for you, you can just put your card details right here and hit pay. So this money is going to come into your um, wallet. So in your wallet, you are going to see the money right here. So if I scroll up, if I scroll up, you can see that my account balance is currently 0.02 Kobo or whatever this is. So you are going to see your own right there. And then you can click on renew plan. And then you can see the plans that they have right here or you can just come here and say you want to change the plan so let's see if this is going to come up now so you can just click on that i don't know why it's not coming up but ordinarily it should come up 
so when you click on that you are going to see the different plans that they have and then you can select that and you'll be ready to make your payment so you can again add funds to your wallet again you can click on add funds and you can repeat the process that we just did now to see some of the offers that they have for you you can come here and click on offers and you can see the different offers that they have for you so this is basically how to use the spectranet app i searched for this kind of video when i bought this device i did not see it. that's why i decided to make this video if this video helps you please like this video subscribe to my youtube channel my name is good Noel. i will be making more videos about spectranet and stuff like that so if this sounds like something you are interested in then please subscribe and um, thank you for watching i'll see you bye bye